Hello folks, uh, yeah, gonna draw another Christmas cartoon. Uh, quick one, quick one, because I need to go to the gym in a minute. <coughs> so yeah, my bladder is at stake if I don't get this done in time. Dun, 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 dun. So let's take this mission where bladders will explode. Bum, 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 bum. That's not quite right, but never mind. Um, yeah, so, um, yeah, so it's a, guess what, it's a cow. Is it always a cow? Does it have to be a cow all the time? I know it says world of cow, but it's a world of cow and other things are in this world that I have created. So there. Sometimes I, uh, sometimes I do uh, get people going, there's no cows in this world of cow. Well, there's, yeah, they are. So there you go. Deal with it. <laughs> uh, right, so, uh, yeah, I like that. Sometimes, you know, you don't fall in love with your line work. If it's wrong, it's wrong, and get rid of it. Okay. Uh, so, this is going to be a happy cow, so do some happy lines. Like that. That's smizing, that is. Smiling with your eyes. Uh, I think I first saw that. No, I was going to say SpongeBob. I don't think so, but he does that a lot. Anyway. Yeah, still, um, what you've got to do, you see, is uh, you still bring the dust and you make it your own. Because uh, there's a guy, I'm not going to say his name, but uh, it's the only bit of good advice he ever gave me. The rest he was, uh, he was a nut, nutbag. Anyway, right. So, I'm just drawing in this, uh, this happy cow. Uh, and it's too big. Uh, so I'm just going to make it a bit smaller. Yeah, that's about right, I reckon. Yeah. And that's with the tra free transform tool. And what I do is... Um, Same aspect ratio. Um, where is it? Scroll, scroll, scroll. Got all the speed. Yeah, uh, the width and that. I lock it so it's it's it scales down correctly. So um, I, I was thinking about the cow uh, thing uh, talking to another cow, and then I thought, no, nah, you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna do her on the phone. Why not? You know, might as well. It's my cartoon strip. Uh, and I thought it was quite funny. And she's ringing her mum. Who's probably another cow and probably in the same field. It makes it even funnier. Uh, yeah, so anyway. So yeah, I thought I'd just do it on the phone. I thought it's quite. Well, you know what? I mean, it's like science fiction. It's not really looking into the future. I know it kind of is, but it isn't. It's. Uh, it's an allegory, usually. Good science fiction usually sort of shows you uh, the world you're in and mirrors it and uh, reveals something you didn't know. Like uh, like Data was um, Pinocchio, in a way. And he was teaching us, asking questions like, what is laughter? And like, oh yeah, crikey, you know. What, what is a joke? What, what, why is that funny? And asking those questions uh, informs you, the viewer, of, of what these things are, and uh, that's what made Star Trek Next Generation great. It uh, did a lot of this kind of reflection on hu what makes us human. And I can't draw an adapts. Um So, World of Cow, a lot of it sometimes, is just a kind of reflection on uh, society. You know? So you don't have to be too literal, so long as it's funny, uh, and, you know, uh, that's that, really. As long as it's funny, it don't matter, really. Alright. So, yeah, oh, that's quite nice, actually. Quite a nice shape, isn't it? I just think that's a bit big. And uh, maybe I need to do a. Oh, I'll tell you what, I can't do it, never mind. No, 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 do it, do it. Yeah, okay, yes, because I forgot. Part of the joke is that she's got a kind of woolly hat on her udders, like a knitted kind of tea cosy. 
Uh, you don't have. You know what? I don't think I've seen a two KZ for about fifteen years. Tea cases were the things they're like little woolly things that you used to put in your teapot to keep them warm. Any of you um, out there? I, you know what? I, re I reckon a lot of kids in England don't even know what a tea case is now. Oh dear, times are changing. I blame the internet um, and tea bags. <laughs> Anyway, yeah, so what I do um, is, I, you know, I choose where I want the legs and I just go over the line and then um, rip out the line work with a rubber, take out the bits I don't want. Uh, it's just like drawing in a sketchbook, really, uh, with a pencil or something. Oh, hang on. There we go. She's standing on snow, so to sort of show that make her sink into the snow a bit and I'm just going to sharpen that line with the rubber uh, nick that line out as well she's standing there talking to her mum I mean this is basically the joke really uh, yep I thought of this one this morning when I was in the bath very annoying had to get out the bath and uh, draw it in my notepad Pad wet. It was a bit, you know, stressful. Had a nice relaxing bath, but never mind. Right. And there we go. So she's standing there in the snow. Can't get it. Going the wrong. In the wrong. Yeah. Right. So I do. Oops. I do a copy of that. Right, and um, flatten one. So I've got one line copy, and I've taken the other one away. See, so there's one lined one, and one anyway. Uh, do that at forty percent, I think. Then I'm getting the magic wand and creating a kind of template of just the sky, because what I want to do is airbrush. always do this as well, the cows like this quite nice sometimes, oops, missed a bit, hang on a minute, let me just ink drop that in, and then a bit of white, 30%, no, I did that wrong, yep, and then, yeah, a bit of white there, then in the background, just to make it Christmassy, and I'm doing it leaning outwards this time. Don't ask me why, I just think it works with the composition. I think it's because of the horizon I've done. There we go. Um, do that at 30% and you get the kind of graduated tone that I put on. So it makes that look graduated. Uh, and then just stick the nose on and the interior, which I've got to do it at. Goals. Woo! Using the history tool to amend what I just did. Then you, I often think that I can use the history tool in life, and you can't. It doesn't work like that, unfortunately. So the others, and then uh, this I think should be a kind of pinky colour. And then let's stick some. tools and make that blue uh, yeah no that blue yeah like that and then maybe some purples that's a nice knitted kind of other cozy 
get in the vibe and maybe just bam no I don't like that uh, Peppy Green tick bags. No, don't. <laughs> because I've got the line work above it, it doesn't interfere with the line work. Well, above it. Which is quite nice. So, yeah, that looks quite nice. I'm quite pleased with that. And, yeah. Okay, so let's just put a highlight on the others. Oh, a bit of yellow there. What's that one? And yeah, okay. So a bit of shadow just to give her a bit of depth there and maybe just on the leg. And oh yeah. And I think a little bit of shadow there as well to pop it out. Yeah, that, that looks nice. Pleased with that. Okay. And let that colour in. And horns. Right. And I think interior of mouth. Again, to just pop the mouth out. And teeth, because it's all sort of white on white. Yeah, that makes it look a bit sort of dopey. Oh, and save it. <laughs> just in case there's a power cut or anything. <laughs> Well, it's a 1,277, I think. Um, uh, 76. There we go. Save that. Always save your stuff. Uh, nothing worse. Well, there is plenty of things worse, but it's really annoying when you almost complete something and goes hideously wrong and you lose everything and you have to do it again but you know having said that sometimes when I have to do that so usually by the sort of time I do it better the second time I do it so in a way it's a mixed blessing right so I'm um, just going to put a shadow underneath like that just to put her on there we go and the what's she saying here she says uh, thanks, Mum. It's just what, whoops, what I always wanted. And oh, exclamation mark! Hang on a sec. Let me just change it to that one. That's nice. I'm happy with that. Uh, I think just what I need to do is make it a bit more Christmassy. I'm going to do another level and do some snow. <sighs> ah. <laughs> I'm willing up. So, yeah, that's that's the joke. Uh, I think I might actually add that one on Christmas Day. So. Uh, have a lovely one, and I'll uh, I'll speak to you later. See ya. Bye.